when it comes to you and the Bible, nobody is preaching the Bible to you. You are the one who opened the Bible. And you are reading. This should be your father speaking to you. I don't know if I'm communicating to you. Don't, don't go everywhere. To you for Christ. Christ is in the world. Christ is in the world. You don't need to search the heaven. Oh, you know, let him out. Wow, no, Kiri. That somebody is telling you that there are seven heavens. Tell me, can I or no major lombe? When I climbed the first one, hmm. then I decide I ascend again to the second heaven. And I saw angels. Ah, These angels I saw. Ah, they turn their head down. Oh, do you they are using head to war. Oh, ah. Magic kingdom. Oh, no, I used to tell my student in Bible school. I made me to say it in the way I used to tell him. I used to say it in the way I used to tell him. I do tell them that. 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 I do tell in those days, there is a Yoruba translation Bible that is called Mixed Up Verses. Do you know that one? The Bible we are reading now, you see verse 1, followed by verse 2, followed by verse 3. In those ones, if you are looking for verse 5, you got to open your eyes and see because it was interwoven. Moments of work. I do tell them that the faith we met on ground is a mixed one. The gospel our fathers practiced were mixed up gospel. That's why we have some years of messing up. When I finished from my Bible college, listen to me. A servant of God told me, Joseph. Joseph Lord, go and establish a church so you can have something to eat I want that of me it's an elder that told me oh, oh, listen. Oh, oh, you can't pay house, house rent me you can't pay school fees go and establish a church you have the gift you have the charisma you have the charisma this is word in your mouth don't be making your family to go hungry what else do you need An elder in faith told me. We want to give you praise for who you have. You are the truth. And there is nothing truer than the truth. And your word is yea and amen. You are not a liar. As mighty as you are, it is impossible for you to tell lies. You are not a politician. You are not a you are who you were in the ancient past. And you shall ever and forever be who you have been even before beginning began. Be na si ni o je o si tu ma je eni ti o ti je ki aye to wa. It is a great opportunity for us to have you as our father. And for ni la la ni fun wa la ti ni o gege bi baba wa. We bless you because you have drawn us into this place. Adukwe lo wo re to ripo ti fa wa wa si bi. And in our series of study you have brought us to the end of this our series. Ni you started with us and you ended with us. Oh, 
and in the course of the journey. Enemies did their best. And what? I bring your duty one. And Lord, we prevail. Glory be to your name. Lord. Oh, go. Thank you, Father. Adupe Baba. We are standing on your promises. If it were to be human beings that have promised us, we know with human beings we always have promise and faith. But you are always committed to your word. Forever, your word is settled. In heaven. Thank you, dear Lord. May we pray that you will speak to us again this day in the name of Jesus. I pray for myself and for my beloved brethren here. May you help our heart to cleave to your wall. And whatever be the situations and the circumstances around us, may we remain unmovable concerning your word in the name of Jesus. Thank you, dear Lord. Glory be to your name. In Jesus' name, we pray. If you started this series with us and you are ending with us, would you like to shout hallelujah? Please be seated. <coughs> we are looking at the last study in our series of carrying Jesus. And today, and uh, we are looking at study 19. I want to trust the Lord that we, we start this today and we shall end it. Can you turn your Bibles to First Thessalonians? Verse 5. Verse 24. Chapter 5, verses 23 and 24. First Thessalonians chapter 5 verses 23 and 24. Are you there? She eh? Okay. Verse 23. The very God of peace sanctify you holy. Ki olorun alaafia ki o ya yin si mi mo pata pata. And I pray, God, your whole spirit and soul and body be preserved blamelessly unto the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. Verse 24. Faithful is he that calleth you who also we do it. Beloved, don't forget that somebody called you and I into the Christian faith. None of us, even if you are born by a pastor, none of us voluntarily want to be a Christian. It was divine calling that drew us into this life. If you really have the life. Ko si eni keni nunu wa. Bo ya ulu shwa gotan lo ti e bi wa. Ko si eni keni nunu wa. To un finu fe do. Wa si ni unu ya jo kristeni yi. An jo ni bak bo yi. Bi obati. Jo ekpo lo to lo to lo ni yi eni nunu. So. God who called us. We are told here that he is faithful. Allah on to kwe wa. And from the text I read in verse 23, he is the only one who is able 
to sanctify us totally. Ah, uh, ni bi e si oro lò un ti a ka yi, ni un we te salo ne ka kinori ka, eh, ka anon yi, o un e kan lo le so wa di mi ma, pata, pata. And to be sanctified totally involves our spirit, our soul, and our bodies. Lati di mi ma, pata, pata, o ni she kwe lu okan wa, e mi wa, a ti ara wa. And only God can do such a sanctification of our tripartite being. Oh, Lord, only can lo le she is so the mima ta eda wo ni po meta yi lo le so wa the mima or lord, can lo le she and only him can also preserve us to be blameless until the day that Jesus will come to take us home. Oh, ni can back and now see ni o le pawama lati wa ni alai la buku titi ti jesu yo fi wa mo wadele. And since this is his work. Ni wan ba ti o ti jek pe yi shere ni e yi. And he is faithful. O wun si je o lo to. He will also do it. Yo shebe. And so, the subject matter for us today is the, the guarantee of being kept in Christ to the end. And la ta ri e yi, a kori e kwa wafun to ni ni e dani lo ju wikpe, a o pa waman ni no Christi titi de o kwen. The guarantee of being kept in Christ to the end. E dani lo ju wikpe a o pa waman ni no Christi titi de o kwen. Before we go to the preamble, ki a to wano i fara lo, let me add more tests. De ki in fi kon e si oro lo nou yen. Just one test. Uh, chapter of the Bible, then the two verses there, Jude. I want to read the last two verses, 24 and 25. Just to give you assurance of our of our preservation in Christ to the end of our race. Lati le fun wa ni dani lo ju e da bobo ati abo to wa ni no Christi titi de opin aye wa. Verses 24 and 25. Ota kan Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. Nje fun eni ti o le pa yin mo ti e ko ni subu Ti a ole, ti ole, mo yu duro kwe lwa yo, ni wadju o gore, la e la ba wan. Who is that person, please? E jo, ta lo le jele yi. God is able to keep us from falling. O, lor on e kan so so, lo le pa waman, la e shubul. Only him alone can keep us to be, and present us faultless before the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh, ne kan lo le, mo wa wa si wa ju Christi Jesu la i la ba wan. To the only wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Oh, Lord, on ne kan so so, o lu wa wa, ne pa Jesu Christi, o lu wa, ni o go, o la, a ti, a she wa fun, ki, a to da ye, a ti ni si sin, a ti 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 la la, a ni kwe kon, Amen. May the Lord bring increase upon this word in our heart in Jesus' name. Ki olu wako mo imukboro wa si orore ni nwa kama luru kwa Jesu. Now let's come to the preamble. Eje ka wa sinu we ifara wa wa. Don't forget the subject is the guarantee of being kept in Christ to the end. E mak bak be o e dani lo ju wikpe a okpa wa ma ni no kristi titi de okpe ni akori e kwa wa. And we have two subheadings. Asi ni akko yo okpe si ekpa meji. The guarantee of infallible promises of being kept to the end. E dani lo ju a wan e le riti ko le ye wikpe a okpa wa ma titi de okpe. We shall peruse those scriptures promises. Ao wo awan e si oro loro nye ni si shentele. Those infallible promises of God. Awan e leri e si oro loro nto ni she kwe lui leri ti akole ye. Then the second of topics, the means that guarantee being kept to the end. E pak e jini onan ti akba ni dani lo ju e paman ti ti de o kwen. Now come to the preamble. E jaka wa si bi fara. God has made Ample provision for us all. Olorun ti pese 
who came to God through Christ for our journey in this country of grace from the beginning to the end. We have scriptural guarantee of being kept in Christ to the end of our race till we enter into eternal glory. However, we also must be aware of the possibility of falling through carelessness, unbelief, and forgetting what we ought to continuously remember as we move on the realm of light. Sibe, sibe. Abodomo wikwe, ije she wa ki a shubu, ni pa a i bikita, a i bagbo, a ti i bagbe, a won ti o ye ki a ma fi sinon e ranti, nne kwen mwen le yi. Whenever there is a fall, there is certainty of rising and bouncing back to keep on in the race. Ni ba kubba ti i shubu ba wa. Ani dani lo ju yi di de ki a si tu pa da bo si po si o ju ona. But unfortunately, as we have seen in the past history of the saints, both in the Old Testament and in the New Testament, some fell and never rose again and became a colossal waste. Shuban, o si eni la anu wikwe a ti ri ni nou yi ta anwen eni mima ni nou ma je moun a ti jo a ti tu tu Pa pa pe anwa kan shubu wwa kosile di dema wwa si di eni adano pata pata. Now listen. Jogbo. If by the fine mercy you are a child of God. Bi oba jekwe ne pa ori ofi o long o di yom o long. If by the grace of God you have experienced the salvation of God. In the gospel. Ti oba jekpe ne pa ori o fi o long. O ti ni iri iri ikbala. Ni no in rere yi. And to be saved by the power of the gospel. Is to be translated from the country of sin. To the country of grace. Ki a ti pa se in rere. Akbara in rere gbo. O ni pe ki ya si o ni po pa da. La ti lu e she. Si lu ori o fe. If you have left Egypt. And you have come to Egypt. Canaan, and that is the country of grace. Be o ba ti fi yi jibi ti si le, ti o si ti wa si Canaan ni, e yi ti in she ilu o ri o fe. Now you are on your race, you are on your journey to heaven. O wa lo ri ni a jore lo si ilu o ron. God has provided all that you and I needed to make it to heaven. O lo ron ni no anon re ti kpe si. God have actually put everything in place for us from the beginning of our journey to the end of that journey in eternal glory. God will never call anybody into Christ and for that person to end his or her life in the waste. Olorun o ni pe enikenu sinu Christi furu fe ni be lati parin rin ajo re sinu ofo ati adanu. But we must let you know the reality of this journey. Sugbon agbodo je ko ye yin okodoru oro yi irin yi despite that God has made provision for our making it and succeeding in the race there is possibility of falling in the race. Bi o ti le je kpe, olorun ti se ipese, sile fun irin jagara wa loju ona yi, sugbon o le se se ki eniyan o subu ni oju ona na. Three things are the causes of falling for the saint in this journey. Awon o meta kan gbogi wa, ti ma n gbe awon ayan fe subu ni oju ona yi. He don't need to talk about the devil. Ah, ni lo lati soro ni pa esu. We know the devil is a hack enemy of God and a hack enemy of the saints. Oh, that was a lot of people. A suje or ta olonu. 
And uh, the devil is bent to make sure that he destroy anyone, especially whoever that want to follow Jesus. But three things give devil chance in the life of the saints. Number one is carelessness. When we are careless, it is possible to fall. Number two, unbelief. When we allow unbelief in our heart, that is, anytime we don't believe the word of God for what God says in his word, surely we are going to fall. Then number three, when we forget what we supposed to remember continuously. Don't forget Roman 6 is knowing this that your old man is crucified. Once we forget that it is Christ's power that we are expected to trust in as we journey in the journey. And we are about to be able to live in the Christian name and all of us Anytime you trust in your stress self. Nigba kigba. Nigba kugba. Ti oba beke le agbara rare. Aha. Because the Bible says, by human strength, no man will prevail. Tori, we mi man we pe ni pa agbara e ni nyan. E ni ken yo ni le koni le nyan yo. So, anytime we forget that we do need to trust ourselves or trust anybody. Ni pa ti aba agbe pe ko ye ki agbe ke le arawa. Shikman ka agbe ke le olon. So, surely falling will happen. Dadu, dadu, ishubu yo de. Do you follow to this point? Can I leave that with you? Now, let me also tell you. Whenever there is a fall, there is certainty of rising. There is certainty of bouncing back. To come back in the race. And to continue. Come to Proverbs chapter 24 verse 16. Proverbs 24. Proverbs 24. Verse 16. The word of God says. For a just man falleth seven times. He riseth up again. Yo to the day. There is no falling for any seat in this race that there is no certainty for him to rise again. And there is no amount of the terribleness of their falling that there is no possibility for them to bounce back again. Bi isubu wan se le buru jaito ti ko si ire ti ati pada bo si po fun wan mo so on account of this word of god lori agbon oro olorun yi i decree to the saint anywhere mo pa se loruko jesus si awon ayan fe christi ni bi bi falling ti won ti subu that they will rise again bi pe won o dide le kan si loruko jesus christi and as many of them that have been crippled by their falling eh to je pe isubu won ti ra won mu sikun I pray this day. Strength will come to their ankles. Strength will come to their nails. They will bounce back again. They will surely fulfill the vision of God for their lives. They will deliver their mandate. Micah chapter 7. 
This is a warning to you and a warning to me. Do you know any saint that are falling? Please don't mock them. Don't mock them. When you see any giant that you know, be obari aki kanju kanti oman that have fallen. Ti o shubu. Sometimes we have saints that have never fallen. Ah, nikba miran ani a wan anyo fe a wen ni mima ti wan shuburi. But because we have agent of devil among us. We like to blackmail them. We spread bad news about them that they are falling. Now, when you connive with wicked men or wicked women to spread the news of the falling of the saints, I need to announce to you what is going to be your judgment. Pelu awen ni buburu lati ma kede isubo awen ni mimo olorun je n kede unti o je idajo re follow me to Micah chapter 7 tell me lo sinu we Micah ori keje verses 8 to 10 ese ke jo si ese ke wa rejoice not against me ma yo mi iwo ta mi oh my enemy iwo ta mi i want to plead with you mo fe bebe pelu re don't be enemy of the saints ma je o ta you know why am I pleading with you not to do that? The saints of God are the harpoo of his eyes. He will fight their cause. He will defend their cause. Say rejoice not against me. Oh my enemy. When I fall. Please mark this word of God. He didn't say if I fall. In this race, God does not design that we should fall. But we do fall. When I fall, I shall arise. When I sit in the in darkness, the Lord shall be a light unto me. I will bear the indignation of the Lord because I have sinned against him until he plead my cause. If the saints fall, is that through carelessness or because of his unbelief or because he had forget what he's supposed not to forget. God might measure certain judgment upon him. But be sure that why is it in darkness? That is when the judgment of God was upon him. Or her. But surely the light will come. Because God has a covenant upon his saints. The day we are called, he said, I will not leave you. And I will not forsake you. That is the promise of God. He said, I'm going to be your father. I will be your God. So when God made a commitment like that, he mistakes or the falling of the saints does not disannul what God has spoken. Said, if I bear his indignation because I've sinned against him, he said, until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me, he will bring me forth to the light. And I shall behold his righteousness. Then she that is my enemy shall see it. And I don't know why the Bible you she. Do you have she in your Bible also? Along with San Ren, you been you. She, Abi, is it my own Bible hello? She that is my enemy. Hey, it's all your time, man. Nick Ban on your time, Lou and B. Nick Ban on your time. She that is my obeying. Obeying, it's all your time, Hallelujah. 
Look at verse 5 of chapter 7. Trust ye not in a friend. Put ye not confidence in a guy. Keep the doors of thy mouth from her. Do you have high in your own Bible again? Uh -huh. Do you see the Bible? Keep the doors of thy mouth from her that lieth in thy bosom. The person that, that you put your head in her bosom. And it all You know, when a man put his head between two breasts, that is bosom. Ah. That's listen, listen. God is perfect in his wisdom. A man, a woman, you are buried your head in her breast for many years. Can become the enemy of your life. Then. then she that is my enemy shall see it and shame shall cover her which said unto me where is the Lord thy God my high shall behold her and now shall she be trodden down as the Maya of the streets. Oh, no, your city at a male, Pierre, need a bang. This creature will be the portion of the enemy of your soul. A yo, dear, a lady at my jambo on farm or talk on it. Don't ever in your life, don't much, much, be your dwell in one year. Even if you caught a, a, a saint in a fall, be your party, a wash, a ship, or say, conke. Oh, why do you any me money be to take this subu? Don't ever spread it. Don't mark it there. Oh, God. David said when he was writing his elegy concerning this falling of Saul. David said, declare it not in God. Don't let the Philistine hear about it. Don't let the Philistine hear about it. It was saying fish. You bring him a Bible study. You are. It's not that you are only sick. There is a cause over your life. Eh, go on, Belodi. Some of you that you are stupid with your mouth. Can you don't just be a yashiwere? Belu ora enuni. The saints will fall, but they will rise. Any mima. If you see them, you need to pray for them. Because that is it. Now what are we dealing with? We told you that God had made ample provision for our success in this race from beginning to the end that God assure us that we shall be kept in Christ to the end of our race and the end of our race is eternal glory now, we now told you that it is possible to fall in this race. And if they fall, the Bible says, even if they fall for seven times, they will rise again. And Michael said, if you find me falling, don't rejoice. Don't rejoice on the saint that falls. There is danger in doing that. 
Can I leave that with you? Let's go on. Probably you are thinking, can I make it to the end as a new creation because of the flaws of temptation, trials and tests that have swept many mighty men away? Mm. I don't know. Do you do you really think like that? She won't know She me o dem show dem I don't know if you have seen giant that have fallen. Me ma boy o ti dia wa ki kanji to ti shubu. I had such problem. This kind of a thinking when I was very, very, very small in Christ. Mo ni ru shuru ba ni ba ti mo shi je o domo de no Christi. No, when the giant, some giant, I knew that they fell. I was like, "Can I make it?" Ah, I want to do something more. Want to do more work? Yeah, she she only more daily by. Let's go on. You read about it, and you consider your own littleness in all aspects. Oh, kawe ni pare. Oh, si wa wo. Mi wa papa she kere to ni gogo ona. You know, you consider that you are little compared to them. Such falsities are coming among church people, though they might be sincere in making such state, but they are ignorant and they are deceived and also deceive others. You refer one, you know, you know, you know, you won le ma soro yi ninu otito kan won sugbon won je alai mo kan asiti tan won je awon papa si ntan awon elomiran praise the lord you no know, sometimes when you know some great men of god nigba mi te ba ma won iranse olorun lanla or you read about great men of anointing tabi e ka we tan nipa awon eni nla olorun awon eni ifa mo ran yan lanla i see how they handled their christian life they were wo bi won ti pari irin ajore eje won sometimes you feel like if it if it could be have if it could happen to green tree how much more dry tree eh e wa ro pe bi le ba sele si kititu melo melo wa ni gigbigbe mi and sometimes you have some people who tell you that you that you are little like this you better stop this your doing green green christian life some have gone ahead of you they fell you cannot also make it nigba mi ran e ri awon agba oponu kan ti won so fun yin pe iwo to kere bayi awa gan ti se ju e lo e o re wa gbe yin ni yo to fe ri o gana gana to nse kaakiri o je farabale please don't listen to them jo ma gbo ti won o they have been deceived adete ni won won ti tan won o ti bo lowo won apere ti bo lowo adete won o ti dete for the father it happened to them nitori po sele si awon it's not a rule ko kin se ase ko kin se ilana is not the rule. O kin se ate ilana ta tele. We are they are failed. Ni bi ta won ti kuna. You will never fail. Iwo o ni kuna loruko Jesus. I used to pray for my children. Mo ma ngba duwa fa won mo mi. I both spiritual and biology. Ati te mi ati tara. Anyone that care to listen to me. Eh ni ke ni to ba gbiyan ju lati po te. I have areas that have failed. Mo ni awon agbon ti mo ti kuna. I always pray that where I have failed, you will never fail. Mo man gba duwa pe ni bi ti emi ti kuna ti mo ti si won o ni si. We have mercy they will not miss it. Ipe bi ti mo ti si mu awon o ni si mu ni be. Because they must be better than I do. Nitori pe won gbodo tayo mi ti tayo la ni won. Yeah. I am a pathfinder. Emi eni ti fi po ro na han fa won eniyan ni. You know when you are the pathfinder. Nigba ti o ba je ala na, olulana. You will face a lot of things. Wa doju ko opolopo nkan and those who are coming behind you. Awon to si nbo leyen eni o si na yo yo doju ko opolopo nkan. Aha. And anybody that is coming behind. Eni ba si nbo leyen if he key into the leadership si, behind you fe ni be ba wa teri si ito ni adari be di we no fe won o ni kuna tori won akeko ninu ikuna adari yen do you understand so your ba yi the subtle trickery of the enemy of our souls is to keep us depending on our endeavors 
and our own power. Etan ti o ta o kan wa ma lo ni lati je ki a ma gbe kele ipa ati ara eniti ati ara eniti agbara wa. You know, devil always want you to trust in your power. Do you know some of you that you know how to pray? <laughs> you know when you know that you know how to pray, you are in trouble. I am going to pray. I will pray. No, as you are doing, I will pray. You are already a failure. God doesn't help people like you. God doesn't help those who can help themselves. He only help the helpless. How did you come to a point that you know how to pray? And you are boasting about it that you can pray. When the Holy Spirit says, we don't know how to pray. You know that's my trouble when somebody started a school of prayer and he said he want to teach you how to pray. You know what I mean? <laughs> These are ministries that are baseless in the New Testament. I want to say, and I said to you, if we demole, you know, my Jamola, you know, the Old Testament, you know, my Jamola, like nobody is called to train people to pray. I hope any can you like to call any betting bad war. Big bad war, you know, part of kitty. Some of you, you know that you know I can fast. I want to assure you, with your fasting, you cannot make it to the end. That's the truth. Thank you. That's the truth. It is only God that must be our confidence. Excuse me, brothers and sisters. If you are like me, if I say if you are like me, if you are somebody like me, I never struggle to become a Christian. May I announce to you that I had nothing in it. The same way I became a Christian is the same way I became a servant of God. So it is just purely mercy and grace. So and it is the cross that have given me that opportunity. So if I will boast of anything, brothers and sisters, it is in the cross of Christ. I have no confidence in prayer. I have no confidence in my fasting. I don't even know how to fast. Some people are good at marathon. I am a lazy rat in marathon. If I'm disappointed, I'm sorry. I don't do fat marathon fast. If you are good at it, please continue. But don't trust your marathon fast. You will surely fail. So don't let devil take you from that hand. Or you believe in your righteousness. I know me, I don't commit sin. And I will not commit sin. I know what I am doing. Moment, ah. Moment, <laughs> Moment, you are the right. <laughs> So it is the will of God for us to be kept to the end because we are God's children who are entrusted to God's able hands. 
o je ife olorun fun wa lati pa wa mo titi de opin tori pe aje omo olorun ti a ti fi le olorun lowo come to john 5 iwe joan orika 24 please we are going to read i'm not going to elucidate akan ka mi ni so ni pa me to read those scriptures o da ka kan me so olorun yen yeah Verily, very I say unto you, he that heareth my word and believeth on him that sent me hath everlasting life and shall not come into condemnation, but it is pa- but is passed from death unto life. Mo fe ki e mo da ju da ju pe ni ti o ba ba oro mi gbo ti o ba si gbe ni ti o na mi ni se gbo oluwa re ni iya ni pe kun ko si ni wa sinu i da ju osugbon o ti re iku koja sinu iye. Chapter six verse forty. Ori ke fa ise keni. Sorry. It's actually chapter six, verse forty. Lawyer King Kabi. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. And this is the will of Him that sent me that everyone which seeth the Son and believeth on Him may have everlasting life, and I will raise him up at the last day. Into the pay if ever by many pay and the can into body or more. To bag bag bo ni le le ni ya ni pe kun emi fun ami osi jidi de ni ken ni ojo iken. Second Timothy one. Wait, Verse 12. For the which cause I also suffer these things, nevertheless I am not ashamed, for I know whom I have believed, and I'm persuaded that he is able to keep that which I have committed unto him against that day. Idini yi ti mo fi nji ya ba yi, shukban o juko ti mi, ni tori mo men yi ti mo gbeke le, o si dami lo jukpe, o le pa yi shura ti mo fi pa mo si lowo mo titi de ojo nla la ajo nla ni romans 8:38-39 we are well, letting you see that it is the will of god for us to be kept to the hand an je ko yi o pe ifi olorun ni lati pa mo titi de opin because we as children of god we are handed over to god's able hand to be kept tori awa gege bi omo olorun a fi wa si owo olorun lati pa wa mo Sec Romans 8, 38 and 39. For I am persuaded that neither death nor life, nor angels, nor principalities, nor powers, nor things present, nor things to come. Tori Moni Danilodu Pe Kosion Kong y Bash Yuku Tabi ye. I bash ya wan geli tabi a wan irumale. Tabi a wan aye u deu ni tabi. Be ni numole ni numole ko so be tabi awon o aye o di oni tabi awon aye tin bo not i non death nor any other creature shall be able to separate us from the love of god which is in christ jesus our lord yala awon alujo nu oju orun tabi awon ebora inu ile go man gbe li lanka yala awon anjo nu oju orun tabi awon ebora inu ile loro kan ko si eda kan ti o le iya wa kuro ninu ife olorun nipase christi jesu oluwa wa i don't know if you believe in this mi mo boyo gbagbo o e da spoke here is not a politician eni o soro nbi o se lo se lu is committed to his word eh o oro re o o faraji fun oro re is able to keep us to the end o se o le pa wa mo titi de now let's look at the first of topic e je ka wo guarantee of infallible promises of being kept to the end e dani loju awon ileri ti ko le ye wi pe a o pa wa mo titi de opin Don't forget our inheritance in Christ is in study 13 of our series of study on carrying Jesus. Ma se gbagbe wi pe ogun wa ninu Christi bi ati se keko ninu eko ketela ninu awon eko wa lori gbigbe Jesu ka akiri. Please will you permit me to just speak out point for you why you do the reading in your house i want to finish this thing now yo se wa gba mi laye kakan yo awon kokokoko ninu kini yi to ki wo lo ma kan nile do you agree with me mo fe pari eko yi lo you have a deal all right now i'm dealing with infallible promises an soro ni pa awon ileri olorun ti ko le ye aha this infallible promises awon ileri ti ko le ye yi guarantee our being kept in Christ to the end. O je ko da wa loju pe a o pa wa mo ninu Christi titi de opin. We have read John 6:40. Abi. Ati ka iwe Juan ori kefa. Come to John chapter 10 verse 28. Wa sinu we Juan ori kefa. John. Iwe Juan ori kefa. Are you there? 
Okay. Verses 28 and 29. Mo fun yin ni iya Say and I give unto them eternal life and they shall never perish. Neither shall any man pluck them out of my hand. Do you believe that? Do you know the person that spoke here? So many who saw on me. Eh? Christ. So many who saw Jesus. Say, no one. Only could see any Kenny. No man could see any Kenny. Shall able to pluck them out of my hand. So lay down one bar. Mommy, Lord. Why? Verse 29. Kennedy. My father, which gave them me, is greater than all. And no man is able to pluck them out of my father's hand. Oh, ti baba ame ti fi fun mi to bi ju bo bo wong lo. Ko si si eni keni to le ja wong ba mong baba ame lo wong. I think that should give you rest of mind. Mo le ro kwe yo ya ke le yo fun ni si mi ok. Hebrews 7. Iwe be ro ri ke je 25. S25. Wherefore he is able also to save them to the utmost that come unto God by him, seeing he ever liveth to make intercession for them. Now we are having these promises that. Our lives are kept in God's hand. And the life that Jesus gave to us is not a temporary life. It is eternal life. Please, do you understand this? So you are. Now, for me now to retain for me eternal life. Lati I do not have what it takes. I cannot keep my eternal life by self-effort. I cannot keep it by struggling. It's just a choice I have to make. And what will be my choice? My choice is to rest on what God has said in His Word. I must rest on the work that the Father is doing over my life. I must rest in the work that the son is doing on my life. I must rest on the work that the Holy Spirit is doing in my heart. Because of it now, the Trinity are working on our lives. Baba is working. Baba the Son is working. The Holy Spirit is working. So on this basis of the work of Trinity and the infallible promises from the mouth of Jesus that should give you and I rest that surely you are going to make it to the end that is a confidence in the word of God. And that is why somebody like me. I don't think that I will go to hell. I do not have confidence in myself. But I just know. That my life is not in my hand. My life is in the hand of the Father. 
Just the way when you carry a child. You know when you carry your baby. Do you ever think that your baby is thinking that he might fall in your hand? Eh? And excuse me, can you fall? Eh? Eh? If you carry your child, you cannot fall. I'm only asking you questions. Your, the child you are carrying has confidence in you that he will not fall. He feels secure in your hand. Then I'm asking you questions. You that carry the child, can you fall? Now, if you fall, what will happen to the child? Oh, God. This is my own rest. My life is not in the hand of any pastor. Pastor can fall. I will not fall. Pastor can fall. I will not fall. Do you know why? My life is in the hand of the father. And the father can never fall. So if you want to push me, for me to somersault from grace to the graveyard of that I will just laugh you to scorn because my life is not only in the father's hand is eating in Christ in God do you see my own confidence? I don't know if you will join me in, in that kind of confidence in God. I have never been anxious in my life. People that doesn't know God. I want you one more long. He may be shouting, Oh, call I will fall. Oh, my father will call out, Shubu. He has backslap. Oh, Tim Benyida. Do you know? Do you know what is called Christian race? She will want to be a religious Christian. The man saw what to be. No, do any tea is so more long. Big bat here. Tea and ban saw a little jani. If you are talking of being born again in the hearing of who is not a child of God, it's like you are talking of dog. Human beings are discussing in the hearings of dog. And when in young sorrow, let ya what we dog know. Kill a jayoma. Eh? Well, I don't know if you have dogs in your house. When, when you and your wife or you and your children you are talking, is your dog know what you are saying? So, people that are that are stranger to the to the commonwealth of grace. I want to People who were only righteous by themselves. I want to want the Pharisees. I want Pharisee. The chief priest, who knew nothing about grace, and you want to protect the children of covenant of grace. No, you don't have what it takes. You only spoil yourself. Do you know what I'm saying? You only spoil yourself. I don't know if you are following me. But if you are not ever in your life being saved, that you have not been drawn by the invisible power of God to the slam. And the Holy Spirit have not made a cutting in your heart. Oh, you are you are out of what I'm discussing. But if you have re experienced the pool, the, there is a divine pool of the Father to the Son. Oh, but he need, he need, FIFA, FIFA can wa, let your door, but see your door, man. Jesus Christ said, no one can come to me except my Father draws him. Jesus, Lord, what we pay? Any can you call me to me? What? The Baba, me team, the Lord, no Baba. You can be a pastor wife, and Baba had never draw you. Ah, 
o le je iyawo olusu agutan ki olorun orun ma si ti fo you can even be a pastor and you have never been poor o le je olusu agutan ti n wa su lori pepe ki baba orun ma si ti fo those who experience the poor i want to want to ni iriri fifa ni and baba always draw them to christ baba ma n fa won wa sodo christ and when they see christ in fact awon ba ri christ they see themselves as sinners let me tell you you don't become born again through dim ambition oh dear to be ni pa ala ati ran some of that i always see the sky is always open for me o kan wa ri ko wa lara pe orun kan si for me and there was this big man that came from heaven i need to tell you okari spectacular encounter has nothing to do with the drawing of the father to the son we are talking of a pool that draw you to ah we are talking of a pool that draw you to Christ not that your pastor draw you know some of you are drawn by pastor eh ko se ko lu se abutan lo fo bi won ti fa wa ka ma si si olorun pa ri sometimes they drew to the altar to the altar and they say you must receive the holy ghost now and they will teach you how to do seke seke and seke seke is what you are doing in the past 25 years wa ma si seke seke a ma mu si test wa ju o de wa se be lo lati fe de funny seke 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 o say we are say after me karaba 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 e de so tell me karaba 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 and say you have received it now yeah Go 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 go. Ati da ku da ku bebe. And 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 you said that is you are you are born again. Wono wa ni po ti di atun bi. No you are born against. O e o e o abi olodi ni. Abi olodi ni. And you always see. Check your Christian life over the years. What you call your Christian life. Wono wo gbe aye Christian ni e o ri pe asigbe omo owo du ni o n to pe ni gba aye Christian ni. You are always against what is God. O man ta ko n to de ti Olorun. You have never bowed to the word of God. Oh, tesi bi oro Olorun tesi ri. You are never submissive. Oh, you are, you are arrogant and unteachable. Oh, je alagi di olori kikun ala ileko ti o si se ko. You are not born again. You are born again. O e so mo Olorun abi olodi ni. So if you have been drawn by the fire. Bi abati fa o wa ni pase baba to the sun. Si omo you can know the son and you remain arrogant. Oh le mo mo ko si wa je alakata kiti alagi do lori kokun sibe. No. Ara coming to Christ make you soft. We wa so do Jesus yo si oro ni. Even if you are hard like Saul of Tarsus. Si o ba ti e je pe o je alagi di bi Saul ara Tarsus you become soft. Waro jebe jebe. You don't you don't experience salvation without brokenness. Ah okay, ni riri balala ise pe awo opale. You are not broken. Ah awo opale. And you say you are saved. Ore nu e owo opale. And now you say you are a man of God. O wa ni ran si Olorun ni o. Or you tell me that there, there is one spirit that is speaking to you. Ipe mi kan ba osoro. I know it is the spirit of the Romanes. The Romanes. The principalities. The Romanes. And the will you be confusing your life. You need to be delivered. I got a doubt. Sile. Please, do you follow to this point? Yo, so, so your baby. So when the Baba draw you to the sun, nigba ti oluwa ba fall. See your daughter. The sun will walk on you. Omo o si sheli olori. The Holy Spirit will walk on you. Eh, mi mo yo si sheli olori. In fact, the Holy Spirit is the seal to put on you that you are God's. Eh, mi mi mo ni onlu. Tao fi di olori pe ti olon lo je. And anywhere you go, ibi kibi ti oba si lo. They will know that you are not his. Eh, shuma kwe o she tong. They will know children of God. We know some of you. Ah. Then let me see some of you. Few of you that are that are possess of devil. Ama, I want to put it in your dark way. If you see one, once you see children of God, be a batty kitty, the body of the long hair down one. And you quickly want to blackmail them. Oh, the fair bound one day to report what they call you just for us to. To change our heart or to have a negative heart against them. Eh, la fun wa la ti ni o kan to lo di si a wan mo lo yen o wa fe ba wan je fun wa. But we are not confused. 
Awa koruju. We know children of God. Awa dom alom iwo loruju fun. We may not talk. Ali masoro. But we know children of God. Ba mantin dom alom. Can I leave that with you? Che mole finye le kwe luwa. Let me look at the means that guarantee being kept to the end. Yaka wo na lati. God will keep us. He always walk through means. Now, these means that we are talking about. Of keeping us to the end. Revolves around Christ. Oh, no, she, ni, 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 Three, in Christ being our shepherd. And four, in Christ being our advocate. Thank you. We shall be kept to the end if we keep on seeing Christ as our Savior. He did not only save us on the cross. Of today, he is our savior. Because if he does not save us, you cannot save yourself. Nobody can save you. So you must walk in the consciousness that Christ, you are my savior. And you shall be kept if you keep seeing him as the Lord over your life. He will keep us safe if we remain be a to be sheep under him as our shepherd. Jesus said, I know my sheep. Say my sheep know me. Say they know my voice. They will not follow any other face. He said, where I go, they will go. Whatever I say, they will believe. So in as much as I see Christ as my shepherd, that I say, the Lord is my shepherd. I know that I cannot keep myself. I know that I don't know the way. It is the shepherd that will lead the way. And once he lead the way, and I keep following, I am sure that I will not miss it. I will make it to the end. Following the shepherd of my soul is not a risk business. No, 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 no. How will I follow Christ the shepherd and I tell myself that I'm in a risky journey? What is risky about it? Following the shepherd is the pathway to victory. When I follow him, once I'm following him, if there is any battle now, who will be the first of seed? After he had fought and finished, he continued the journey. Do I know any battle? You just need to know who are you following. Who is the shepherd of your life? It's not only shepherd. It's also our advocate. He had come. He knew no sin. He committed no sin. And he cannot sin. But me. I can sin. To be saved is not a state of To be saved is not a state of sinlessness. Do you understand? Now, immediately I commit any sin here. This man had booked it. He is not only being with me. He is with the father. 
Anytime I say. I have an accuser. You know my accuser. Satan. You will quickly go. You will Say Joseph for that Joseph for that I've seen it. And he has a mystery around me. But what one now? Satan has a mystery around me. Even when I don't see, and they don't understand my movement, they will, they will conclude that I am sinning. They will report to their guardian. That Joseph had seen Are you with me? So Now, my advocate. No, I pray that this understanding will come on. I'm not speaking to all of you because I know it is not all of you are saved. I know. I know that children of them are here. But I'm talking to children of God. I am alone. So if you are God's children, listen to me. Let this understanding give you rest. So anytime I see. You know, sometimes I may even sin and I don't know. But before my enemy will accuse, the Holy Spirit will tell me, and you for me. Yourself, that thing that you did is not correct. Why did you have to talk the way you have talked? Somebody was abusing me and was shouting at me. So I wanted to close her mouth. And the person said, I've beaten her. Now, in such a situation, I suppose not to stop her. It was a misbehavior. I said, Lord, I'm sorry. So if my accuser go to heaven, my advocate will say, Christ. Christ is my advocate. Jesus la gbojo ro mi o. Say lay that thing that he did to my account. Ni pe in to se ohun e ko se asun won mi. Say baba lay it to my account. Eh e ko baba e ko se asun won mi. Because of him tori ti e I died. Moku and because of him, I am sitting here. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! So Christ did not only die for me on the cross. He is sitting at the right hand of the Father. For me. For me. For me. For me. For me. For me. Even before I sinned, he had been interceding. Baba, you have to have mercy on me. Joseph Olada Pokola. Baba, you know he's human. He's human. He's human. Sometimes they provoke him. He can be provoked. Just have mercy on him. Have mercy on him. Have mercy on him. So when the enemy come, the accuser come. What does he have to do again? He will always return with shame. Yo ma pada wa pelu itiju. Itiju ni o ma je pe awon ota re. Amen. Shame will be the lot of your enemy. Please do you learn to this point. Se o yo de bi. Can I leave that with you? Se mo le fi yan le pelu wa. Still dealing with the means. Ti so ni pa awon ona won yi. Now for us to stay healthy in Christ. God has provided not only Christ as the shepherd. He has also given us under shepherds. Pastors. I'm not talking of pastors with color. 
pastors that are made by grace. Who will fill the church with knowledge and understanding. So for us to be healthy in this race, he has given us pastors, disciple makers, to feed us well. If you have not been doing well in this race, it is because your life lacks diet, lacks spiritual food, balanced spiritual food. If you are exposed to green pasture, I don't know. You know, do you know we are in green pasture here? I don't know if you are receiving comfort for your soul. Are you receiving strength in your soul? So you don't need to remain in, in self-condemnation for years. I need to tell you. There is no sin that you commit that there is no remission for under the blood. There is no how thick your crime is that the blood of Jesus cannot wipe it away. Deliver yourself from ministers of condemnation. Run away from sisters and brothers and sisters who have the ministry of condemnation. Get yourself connected with the right fellowship. So are There is a fellowship that threatens you. A daughter came to me. We were talking. He said, Daddy. Said, Baba. Say, I have sinned. Say, I supposed to have come to you. And she told me her story. Oh, there's so it's for me. Say, sorry. I said it was an accident. And I made an illustration. I said, somebody is hungry. Hungry. And is about to die. But there is a food around her. She does not know the owner. This is food. And I'm dying. Taking this food, I am stealing. Because the owner is not here. But she just concluded for me not to die. Let me eat. And he has heard. I said, the legalists we say, you are a thief. But those of us that are made by grace, we say, you have only heard to quench hunger. This is not a sin. Your father owns the owner of the food. And I told her, I have forgiven you. And I told her, I am with you in this. If nobody is standing with you, I am standing with you. My God is standing with you. We don't receive the ministry of condemnation. Don't you know the scripture says where there is a casting down. There is a lifting up. Rise to your feet. Let us pray. Oh, ha bani la baton. Hey, ha woni la wuton. Ha bani la baton. Oh, Hagbani la baton, hey, ha woni la wuton, 
Oh, save your You are the complete savior. Oh, you are the complete healer. 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 You are the Jesus, ni oruko Jesu Olorun a fi gbogbo ogo gbogbo ola gbogbo ipa gbogbo agbara ati gbogbo ogo fun o tori pa ni olu oluwa ani oni alagbata hawo ni san patapata 
anything ya jong go go anything na ni lowo o ka bi si aki opo se ba ope wa fun imo lokanle fun idani loju iwo ni afeyin ti o iwo ni ki dani iwo ni ki doju ti ni iwo lo ki ke sun si le loro ka bi si asopo se ba ope wa huko ni fun oruko lua nitori na ati bi aye wa to yonda re lotun emi wa aye wa gbogbo e la fi le olotun pata pata oya gba wa afe ko se la se pe pata pata lo ko de su oya se be ni gbogbo ona enu o le fi sun gbogbo ma pa lenu ma gbogbo o lu fi sun oya e wonu tiju oya e wonu ega lato ni lo ogbo lu tiju oya e subu e ni dide oya wa dide awa yo atesi waju awo nu ogolo oju o ti wa aye o yo wa ara nu gba ara nu gba ara nu gba gbogbo ogo ti olorun ogo ni fun oruko lo ogo ni fun ah iko re baba gbe yin ro o e ni subu o e ni sina gbogbo lu fi sun oye wo nu ti jilo o lowo lo bayi lo ruko de kenu yin oro abuku ati ega ko ma je ti won e ti yan yo agba tan baba gba yi ti le ti le o gbe yin lo o di yin mo a en ku alo a o ni sina a o de le o oju o si ni ti wa oko ni fun oruko lu ha ni ni ori ajo wa be ni an kolu ha an to ka si ka pare ni bi e jena o hi dawo lo de ninu lo ta gbe dide jesus lo to wa lo ko se wo mu wa ara o ha ni jesus hi ma ko ju re ke ma ko ni jeje ni pa o ere o ni lu ogo ni ilu ogo ni ka bo so ke la ni mo so e abo e jata ha de il shout hallelujah amen this already done nothing can change it 